He's a real-life Forrest Gump, walking barefoot from Cairns to Manly to raise awareness and funds for men's mental health. Uh, It's day 161 now, uh, so a bit over five months. It's been incredibly challenging. Today, though, the Barefoot Dutchman spoke words of wisdom with the Central Coast Mariners. Walking from Cairns to Sydney, the most densely populated area of Australia, so that way I can speak to as many people as possible, go through as many towns as possible to get the message out there that, you know, especially towards men that having emotions and showing emotions and speaking up whenever you need to is completely fine, that you're only human. It has nothing to do with your masculinity. You know, you can still play footy and work on your car but it just needs to get out there. The 2,600 kilometre walk wraps up on Sunday after Anton walked from Terrigal to Gosford today. The barefoot Dutchman will then make his way through the peninsula tomorrow before catching the Palm Beach ferry from Etalong Beach. It's beautiful, I'm not going to lie, this has actually been the best bit as it comes to, you know, people reaching out. I've had record numbers of people like uh, pulling over with the cars, um, helping out with snacks and drinks and just um, just having chats. It's been amazing since day one I got to the Central Coast. I think it was the first day, it was like 21 cars that pulled over that one day of just having a chat and, and yeah, helping out. So it's been amazing and to be able to walk next to the beach as well, it's, it's absolutely beautiful. The Central Coast's own mental health advocate Brian Dorfling has joined in on the fundraiser. After walking from Brisbane to Budgiewoy and swimming from Bondi to the Central Coast for similar causes. How was that? And obviously he's decorated you as yeah, well. I was going to say, this, this kind of shows who he is as a person. And uh, oh, it's been amazing. He's been walking with me for the last three days. And um, yeah, he's done great things himself, of course, to raise awareness for mental health as well. So it's... It's amazing to connect with uh, a like-minded man and, and to spread the, the message out here in the Central Coast area. Uh, it's bringing back some really fond memories of community, uh, of, of my walk or our walk. And when he was walking through Bajiwoy, a friend messaged me and said, do you know, have you heard of this barefooted Dutchman? I was like, yeah, I think so. And I had a quick look and I was like, this is amazing. So I went to see him. He's such a beautiful uh, character, really jolly. I see you're not wearing any shoes. Now, have you ditched your shoes um, in support of the Barefoot Dutchman this time? I have, I have. I like wearing shoes. I think they're comfortable and soft and squishy, but this legend has done nearly 3,000 kilometres with barefoot, in bare feet, so I thought I could do 100 or so with him. The duo will complete the walk together. Finishing in Menly on Sunday on um, the South Stain, so in, the, in front of the Life Saving Club there, and um, trying to create a bit of a, a, a forest gump moment. So I uh, try to get as many people as possible to walk with me from Queenscliff all the way to South Stain to finish with me and to kind of show um, um, that we're united uh, for all the people that are dealing with their mental health right now and to show that they're not alone. Uh, it will be good to all come together and, and finish this walk together. If you'd like to donate to the cause, please head to our website for details. Sky Hull, Central Coast News.